Hey everybody and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program RP0, the mod suite for the Realism Overhaul series of mods for Kerbal Space Program. Uh, today we are going to ride yet another RA8D. Uh, this time we're trying to do a soft landing on the moon. Uh, I do believe the rocket is fueled and ready to go, so we're just going to go ahead and engage. RCS on, throttle pegged, and ignition. Good, we are ready for liftoff. This payload is uh, right up, well, it's a little heavier than the re-entry test vehicle we did in the last episode, but I don't think it is by any means beyond the capabilities of this rocket. What was I thinking there? Not a whole hell of a lot. Anyway, this rocket's pretty reliable, the launch is pretty standard, and it is at night, so I'm just going to go ahead and pause this recording as soon as I... Oh, crap. Did I screw up? I screwed up. I screwed up. We are... Okay. Well, I'm going to keep recording while I screw up. Now, degree off the focus and way outside of our program vector. This is going to cost me. Marches on this mission were actually very, very tight, so I... Really hoping that, that screw up doesn't cost us the whole flight. Although I guess we'll know when we get closer to orbit. Fighting with this thing. Yeah, yeah. It's not gonna be too much longer like before we get that far off the right before we start getting some serious stability issues. Oh, we have a power loss on one of our boosters. Son of a bitch. Here I was just now talking about how reliable this rocket was, and we have a fucking failure. Ride them clear. Whew. Okay. Maybe now this will be more of a standard launch. Let's see if I can't get that uh, relative inclination to something a little bit more tolerable. Alright, we'll take that. 0.24. Not too shabby. All right, and now we can start angling in in earnest for our... <sighs> Jesus. All right. Up. All right, and now there's really nothing interesting to watch for a while, so now I actually am going to pause the recording, and I will come back and see you guys uh, when we are safely in orbit. And, yeah, well, we made it to orbit. Barely. Thanks to that booster failure and all those steering losses. Um, I don't know... Well, I certainly know we don't have enough in this stage to hit the moon. We might have enough with this... What was intended to be a deceleration or deorbit kick. And what was intended to be our most of our descent stage. Enough to get there. So we're going to try for an orbit or maybe even an impact uh, anyway. We just got to go for the couple minutes or so. Oh man, we might not have a connection. Although, the antennas are booted. We should. Yeah, we should. We'll, uh, we'll see how, if we get within that two minute mark. Now, our orbit is ugly, as you can see by the stuff down there at the lower right. But luckily, our perigee 
is almost exactly where we're going to start this burn, which is really nice. Because then some of that energy that was wasted establishing orbit can get us to where we need to be. Why don't we have that connection? Oh yeah, that is entirely below the horizon. I don't understand why none of these satellites are connecting with us. The antennas are active. Yeah. Yeah, they show active. I can't click on anything for some dumb reason. And yes, we do not have connection. I can, however, RCS. Very unstable. Why are we still very unstable? It should be more than enough to have settled the fuel by now. How I have throttle control, honestly, is a little beyond me, but I don't get why that's unstable. That should be very stable by now. And we should have connection through that satellite that is directly above our heads. Very unstable. What the shit is happening here? Running out of hydrogen is what's happening. No, it's estimated burn one hour. Okay, I thought that was time until... Alright, we're gonna miss it on this orbit. So we're going to just replot for next orbit. Uh, things will obviously be worse, but... Hmm, that's weird. Alright, we'll go for that. In hopes that maybe a little time warping will help our cause a bit. Very unstable. So let's uh, get ourselves out of the atmosphere, maybe. Very unstable. It just will not settle in. That's disconcerting entirely. Alright, now that we're out of the very cusp of the atmosphere, we'll swing it around. Madagascar. Very high pass over Australia. We do have an active connection. Oh, I was entirely too close to the node. Damn it. Just will not settle. What the fuck is happening? Not in the atmosphere yet, so we can't be quote drag. This is super frustrating. Good thing it's got an infinite ignitions, but what the hell? Well, this one is certainly scrubbed. There's just no way. I don't know why this engine won't allege. This really sucks. I guess we're just going to chalk it up to an engine failure. Ready for engine failures. Still nothing. Keep checking the wrong tank. Alright, well, we're just going to leave that here and kick. Nope. Oh, what the... I didn't have the throttle set. 
Well, that's embarrassing. And now I have no connection because I didn't unlock the battery. And now I can't because I have no connection. So this one's entirely scrubbed. I did really great on screwing this whole thing up. And uh, I don't know. I'm not discouraged. I will try again. But this is completely useless. Yeah, I can't even range safety it. Oh, well. All right. Well, thanks for watching me screw up. I appreciate it. I'll see you all next time.